What's up guys, Tavern here, back again with another episode of Let's Play Let's Go Pikachu. So, as you can see, I am not in my main file, I'm still in the same recording session. So, what had happened, um, during part 25's recording process, everything went all smooth and well, however, at the very end when the video was exporting, um, it wasn't fully able to fully um, run it out and everything because I ran out of disk space onto my computer, and me being the dummy that I am, I deleted the extra stuff that I didn't I didn't really think I did need. However, some of that was the rest of the parts I needed for this part 25 to fully like um, render out and everything. So I had to redo this whole part again. So with that, all I did was that part. I came back to see Foam Islands and I caught Articuno, which I'm going to be doing right now for you guys. And then we're going to go back over to Cinnabar Island and I need to go inside the gym or make my way to unlocking the gym so let me go ahead and save right here all the other progress is still saved on that one i just need to catch Ar articuno again at least show you guys that i caught articuno so you guys know hey i didn't cheat when i did this uh let me see i'm gonna have rapidash on the front these guys aren't as leveled as my main party because this was just meant for me to use to catch secondary pokemon But anyway, Articuno is here, and now we need to go ahead and fight it, just as usual, like we did with Zapdos, in order to get it down. Leading in with my Rapidash, I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that Rapidash is able to outspeed it, and I'm going to go for a Fire Blast, because I want to get Articuno to- Okay, quick, good, I do. But you avoid the attack, gosh darn it, and it's going to get even faster. That's annoying. Uh, let me see. You know what? Um, better move instead of doing fire blast. Let me actually go for a fire spin so I can get some damage wrapped onto it And it's gonna go for an ice beam All right, cool. I can take the hit don't get frozen. So I'm good So this will get some small little ship damage going on each turn and now I want to try for another fire blast Hopefully I get lucky with my accuracy and it hits fire blast hit After I get hit by another ice beam Yep Don't get all right cool it hits how much damage is this going to do? Oh, good damage. Do I get a burn? Yeah, I get a burn. Yes. Oh. Okay, don't get too excited. Chest still hurts. Alright, cool. If Honestly, we can, we can just hang out this one last, last turn. So this run actually went a lot better than my first one. Though it wasn't that bad. Roughly going to be the same. I'm going to need one Pokemon in order to do this. Hopefully the catching phase is just as good. Alright cool, I only need it one time, Articuno faints. So now we are in the catching portion of this match. So now, let me go ahead and give it something to eat. I refuse to use that Master Ball, so... Go for the throw, got a nice, that could have been better. Luckily it wasn't moving that much. Only got one shake, that's fine. Oh, now you're going to start moving. Go in the ball! That was good, I almost hit my hand on the table. Uh, uh, oh my god, that was a lot better than my first time. Alright, so we caught our Nakuto. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so fortunate. Okay, hopefully this recording does not mess up so I don't need to do this a third time. I won't save just in case. Alright, so a legendary bird Pokemon. It freezes water that is contained in winter air and makes it snow. I'm gonna go ahead and tuck that into the Pokemon box. And with that, we are done with our business over in this cave, so I'm just going to go ahead and use my escape rope here to get out of here all quick-like. And from here, we are going to surf on back over to Cinnabar since it's not that far off. And let's see here, are there any trainers I need to worry about? Nope, I can avoid you quite easily. Anyone down here? Nope, none that can reach me or see me. Alright, cool, we should be in the clear, so let's go ahead and come back over here. Alright, so, when I went to the gym, the door is locked. There's some message written in small letters on the door. Quiz time, where's the key that lets you into this gym? Hint, the answer can be found somewhere in a building that is overgrown with greenery. Alright, so, we need to come inside this building over here, located to the left-hand side of it. 
And unfor I, since I do know what I need to do for you, I'm just going to skip a lot of the items. However, there are two Pokemon in here that I, I need to catch just to show you that I caught them since that was also gone too. Um, the reason why I'm not getting all the items, like I said, this isn't the main file, so there's no need for me to worry about that. So I'm just going to go ahead and avoid everything and just go where I need to go. And I don't know why I, want I need to go up the stairs. I don't know why I completely bypassed it like there was something over here that I really needed. Oh, but you guys can go ahead and get everything in here if you want. I did it the first time. I'm not doing it again for this file. So let's go ahead and go up the stairs. Let's hit this switch. Uh, let me see. I believe I want to keep going up the stairs as well. And then from here... Oh no, I didn't want to come up here. I didn't need to come here. I didn't Grimer. Alright, not gonna catch you, because I don't need you. Alright, so let's actually go back down the stairs, because I made a boo-boo. I think I want to scour the floor over this way. Those are the stairs I want to go against. Okay, so let me actually hit that dang it radicate. I want to hit that switch again to unlock that door, because that's the, that's the staircase I need to go up. Alright. Alright, cool. So something open somewhere. Let's quickly head up, up these stairs. There's an optional coach trainer we can go against later, but I'll, I'll save that for later in the main file. Uh, where am I at? So from here, I want to turn on this switch, and I want to go down. And we are going to have to fight against this guy over here. Actually, no, we don't. I can ignore him. I can instead go straight downstairs, because there's this one I have to go against. And here's a magmar, which I need to recatch to show you guys be catching it. Alright, so let me go ahead and give you a berry. And toss. Great, hopefully this goes in. Uh, yes, alright, cool. So now we got Magmar added to the Pokédex. Oh, it pays to have a second file ready just in case. Alright, cool. So that's Magmar added to the Pokedex. Now there's only one more Pokemon that we need to recatch um, in order to get caught up to where we were in a main file. Oh, this guy, this guy. Oh, I don't remember what his started out with, so I'm just gonna go on with what I have. So who are you? There shouldn't be anyone in here. You know what? There's a lot of people that shouldn't be in here, but you know what? Gosh darn it, they are. So I don't want to hear anything from you, Ted. It's Electrode. Okay. Ooh, do I have any Pokemon in this team that's good against electric types? I have my Needle Queen. Oh, you have Drill Run. Yeah, we'll, we'll just go for it. Oh, you're gonna use Thunderbolt. Hopefully I can survive this. I can, yay. But I get paralyzed. Don't get paralyzed, please. Yes, go ahead and use Drill Run. It's definitely not gonna one-shot it. But that's fine. Let me go ahead and use an item on you, my sweet girl. I'm so sorry. Let's use a Hyper Potion. You deserve it. Because it's my fault for not healing you after we went against Articuno. You stood up against a Legendary. You are a Legendary, Rapidash. When you use Swift, that's not going to deal that much damage, but it's not going to miss either. Hopefully, I can get off another Drill Run without being paralyzed. Hopefully, I'm gonna use Thunderbolt. How much damage is that gonna deal to me? Alright, cool. Just enough to give me. God dang it! Alright, come on, Drill Run once again, please. Don't get paralyzed. We're just gonna keep going with Thunderbolt. Cool, we got off. And not to knock you out. Of course it is. You only have like a sliver of health left. Alright, so who's the next Pokemon that you have on your team that I need to worry about? It is Muck. Okay, let me. I have to switch out. Um, do you have any ground type? I think you should also have Drill, right? Yeah, you do. All right, so switch into my Needle Queen. All 
And let's see. I should be able to outspeed it, so let's go for drill run. And is this this is oh no, same thing. Almost not quite enough to finish it in one hit, but you did good. I'm very proud of you. Oh, he's gonna go and minimize, that's gonna increase his evasiveness. Well, hopefully I will still be lucky enough to hit him. So I don't need to drag this out. Yes, exactly, cool. Knock him out. It's another one down. I think that's like the last one that we actually need to fight, and I can just avoid the rest outright. Alright, so I'll be on my way, Ted. Have a nice day. Don't really care about that item. I don't care about that one. That one should be a Firestone. I remember that one. Um... There's a teleporter right there. I didn't use it yet. Even though I made one, I forgot to. Let me just come down here. This should lead us into the basement. And down in here is where we're going to find um, the last Pokemon we need to find in here, which is a Ditto. Come down here. Hit this switch so I can open up certain doors. And I can come out here to the left hand side. There's... No, I don't care about that. Alright, cool. Avoid you guys. Cup... Gosh, Buck. I stepped in, Buck. No, I don't want you. Okay. So, in here, there's a bit of... Oh, I need it because I need to actually... Oh! Magmar! Magmar, Magmar, Magmar. Why? I don't need you, but I do need this bed because I can heal my Pokemon up in here by sleeping on one of the beds. So let's take a quick little rest. Alright, no, no, let's not take another one. Oh gosh, I'm not that sleepy. Alright, did, did I already... I don't know if I already hit this or not. Let me, let me see if I have. Because there's a certain gate that I need open. I don't need that. Right, nope, I did not hit it. Alright, I need to come back and actually hit that switch. Avoid you. Okay, now we can go in. Be wary. Eradicate, don't come near me, don't come near me. Oh, gosh darn it. Yeah, it's a huge rat. I don't care about it, though. Oh, no, he. Oh, you were so close to looking around. There we go. That one's a small rat. Alright, so we've come inside here and we want to come down and we get the secret key. So this is the key that we need in order to unlock the gym. So, if we come further up here, here is an item that I will collect. There's a max elixir. And there's a lone pod over here in the center. If we read the plaque on it, it says, A large container made of thick glass. It looks as if something has been beating on it over and over from the inside. So in this game, this is actually where Mewtwo was created, and this is where he was. Now that he's gone, we don't know where he is, but lucky for me, there is a Pokemon that I need to get right here. It's Ditto! And unlike in other games where Ditto's main purpose was to help you with breeding, there is no breeding in this game, so now all I just need him for is the Pokedex. So let's go ahead and capture him, hopefully... Oh, okay, don't need to be rude about it. Just, just say no. Go back in the ball, though. I need you. <laughs> Just to show off that you have been caught, indeed. No, ditto. Ditto, ditto, ditto. Come on now. Oh, wow, you jumped really far. Don't run, please. Oh, I... Go in the ball. Please, stay in the ball, too. Let's see. Yes, cool. Caught ditto again on camera. All right. Let's see, so that should oh no, that wasn't I think that was mostly everything that I did off screen. I don't know if it if I did it in part twenty-four, but I also went into the Pokemon lab and revived all of the fossil Pokemon. Now that I think about I I think I did do that in the last part that wasn't fully recorded, so the only thing you did miss that I can't really re um, replicate again is me showing you guys that I turned in all my fossils to that one guy to get them fully revived. Oh, I need to open up this door again. So yeah, I think that might have been the only thing that I might not have been able to show you guys, so I apologize for that. 
I'll at least go back to that lab to where I was so you can at least see it. And avoid you. And I want to actually come back up these stairs and I want to take that teleporter that we saw on the far right. Just so I can see where it goes. It might just take us outside the building. First, let me talk to this kid. Hey, do you know? If you step on that panel, you can go back to the- Okay, this takes us to the entrance, so cool. Nice little shortcut that I'll just take. Alright, cool. So, that is pretty much going to be it for today's episode. I'm sorry that it wasn't as long as they normally are, but honestly, this was just to repeat everything that I already did, so I'm glad it did not take nearly as long. But anyway, all I came was this room to the far right. I talked to this man over here and gave him my dome fossil, my helix fossil, and my amber fossil so I can get Almanite, Kubuto, and um, Aerodactyl revived. And they're all inside the main file. They're all still in their base form. So I'll be revolving them off screen later on. So thank you guys for watching this episode of Let's Play Let's Go Pikachu with my female character for once. So. Until then, I'll see you guys next time back in the main file with the main roster. So, I'll see you guys next time. So, until then, take care, everyone.